okay for you to start working for a legal corporation in this country. You are unconstitutional. Okay? You blow these signs, you lock people up, you have pedophiles, you have murderers, you have fighting, you have to work for them. Okay, I'm going to go back to the next one. Okay, I'm going to go back to the next one. Okay, I'm going to go back to the next one. Okay, I'm going to go back to the next one. Get a pen yeah, and paint for yeah, you. Thank you, Mom. Okay, so from here, where are we going back to? We're going to the pool station right here. Are you going to the game before the game? What have you done to us? Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? If he had a stop no, there, we would then be here. He's a good man. We're, we're can I, can we, without him, oh, I'm happy to talk to you away from him if you like. I'm happy to chat to you like you know, normal. Okay? If he had a stop in that street up the top after I saw him up in Willow Road, if he had a pulled over straight away, we wouldn't be having this conversation. I would have taken his decal. We'd be all on our way. Yeah, my name's Cindy Cuss, Border from Fabulous Horror Patrol. Yeah. What happens is, as you know, you're working for a corporation. Oh, okay. So we're going to we're not going to have a normal conversation. with then I thought that we could have a normal conversation. Well, this is a normal it's conversation. Not happen. No, it's not. Are you for the people or are you for the corrupt right. corporation? You're quiet. You want to go over it? Yes. Okay. They came with no masks, but they just put masks on now. Yeah. It's well, we've got it I've got some photos. Approved the blue lights, send the cats on straight south by maybe present under breath, okay? So what I advise you to do is take a nice deep breath in, close to the two parts. And at this point, you blow it off. Deep breath in and blow it off. Yeah, and 
Will you charge me whatever price you want to charge me? Okay. okay. I'm going to work out why the pedophiles in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to take it. What are you doing? It's not. It's a medium point. It is. 28. They are pe pedophiles yeah, raping why children? Do people always refer to the pedophiles? Okay? Do you know, I, there are plenty of members of parliament who have been locked up for child sex offences. There's oh, no, doctors, good. there's good. lawyers, yeah. there's school teachers, oh, no. alright? I yeah. can't keep disclaiming the governments are pedophiles, alright? There are police and law enforcement who investigate people who commit child sex offences. You're running out of excuses. Officer. What's happened here? Officer. He's committed criminal offences. He's failed to comply with directions, which is making the situation worse. It's simple as that. All right. We're not evil. We don't work for a corporation. Every officer here has small children. All right. We come to work. We help people. We help people. We, yeah, we protect people, and then we come home to our families, and that's it. And there's a small percentage of people like you who like to think that somehow. You don't have to comply with the laws that everyone else is trying to approve. I'm not we listening to your crap about that's not crap. About we respect the Magna the Carta and all that no, sort of stuff. Have to. You don't respect us because you're committing offences. No, all right? no the, the government. We is. live in one of the greatest countries in the world. And it's been hijacked. It hasn't been it hijacked. It has. It's now a corporation. It's not a corporation. It is. It's got an ABN. You this keep is calling a back phone number. Uh, Can right, I, think Scott I just want to know you. that black flag he's got on the front of his. Um, what is that? Not engaging you... that stuff, right? Yeah, but what is it? He's been locked up for the offences he's committed today. That's it. All right. Well, you just said we've got a great country. We do. Great no, the one on, on the front of his. Have, find out what just, that just means. Step, uh, yeah, no, have a look and we want to know what that means. Guess, you need to know. Sort of look it up. Look it up. You should know what it is know if you're exactly wearing it. What it is, all right? if, well, what is it? What is it? It's a thin blue line. All right. And what's that? a line of officers that stand between the 99% good people in the community and the 1% of criminals that would stand to do them harm, okay? We're the thin blue line between the good guys and the bad guys. Well, you're going to All right? the good guys. Okay. We are the good Right now, I'm not saying he's a bad person, but he has committed offences that everyone else in this country has to Abide. He's, a, he's a great warrior. He's standing up to a lot of the evil that we're putting up with going on now, and that's why they've locked us down. They're taking our rights. They're dealing with fascism. Yes, we are. Every, do you know how many times the? What did you think they did with the Spanish flu? Do you know how many? How, times? how many people do you know? How many people do you know yes. with COVID? Okay, personally. So you officer? don't believe it? No, officer. No. Do you know who? manipulated the Spanish flu, which really started in America. And do you know how many people died in that? 15 million to 100 million, because I do it. we all do a lot of research. No, excuse me, I want to hear, I want you to hear this. No, yeah, no, I, and I want to, I want to explain. The Officer, please hear me. Bill Gates is behind all of this, and Fauci, right? Because software developers no. behind it. Oh, yeah. it's big tech for sure. The UN. Now, what happened is, Al Gates, he was the architect behind the Spanish flu. They injected a lot of the, of the, the army who went over to Europe. They spread the disease all over Europe, and when they came back, they told all the Americans they're going to be jabbed. Now, you know what? Everyone who had that jab died. The people were wearing masks, and a lot of them ended up dying of bacterial pneumonia. Okay. Why can't it simply be there's a virus? No, no, this is this is a tool. This is a tool for a bigger agenda, which is actually fascism. Well, that's, that's your belief. Well, it's definitely what's going on, and that's why there are millions and millions of people around the world who doesn't get media coverage that are standing up to this. And we're going to stand up. For, yes, millions of people you don't. You watch this. Do you, do you know any that have died? Do you know any personally that have died? Do I know anyone personally that's died yeah. in this country? No. No, from COVID? No, no. Well, how is that a pandemic? If it was a pandemic, we would all know people with it. No, I'm talking about here, now. I'm talking about France. 160,000 dead. How do you know? How do you know that's the truth? I mean, the, the media are lying about all of this. Two million people rallied freedom in France. If we don't stand up for our freedom, you are going to be protecting Nazism. What, what do you think is going to happen? Well, you, it's you, the new you, world order. It's you, agenda 21. You're comparing it to Hitler. What was, what was his, his goal? His goal Wiping out his entire races for human yes. civilization, conquering the world. Yes, and we're seeing a repeat. This is the same, this is the same so recipe. So you think the Prime Minister and our Premier intent on 
They're wiping out a whole section of the community, murdering them and taking over the world. You know what? You I'm telling you now, if they would do anything to protect themselves. So why can't be... it simply be some elected officials who are doing everything in their power right now to stop everyone? No, no they're being dictated to by higher authorities. And, and how I know do you because know that? I know some of them, right? You know they're, they're, yeah, they've got their heads tied behind their backs. And I, as 